My fiancé and I kicked his mom off our wedding guest list. Now we are being shunned by his family. How can we minimize the damage? My fiancé, 26M, and I, 26F, have decided to not include his mother, 59F, in our wedding for a number of reasons. Originally, he did not want her there, nor did I, but we agreed it would be too much drama to exclude her. She is a mom to two boys including my fiancé, and has always had an inappropriate relationship with the two of them, though it is much worse with my fiancé. He is the younger one of the two, and she constantly talks about how she doesn't want to lose her baby and how she wishes she could have kept him a baby forever. Won't go into too much detail, but this resulted in her bullying me for the past nine years I've been with my fiancé. Once we announced our engagement and started sending out invitations, his mother was hysterical. She started begging him to call off the wedding, claiming she couldn't take it at her old age, she is 59, and that lots of young couples are choosing not to hold a wedding these days, we can't really be sure yet, we have been together for nine years, it's a waste of money, etc. Things got even worse when we told her there would not be a mother-slash-son dance and we didn't want her having a major role in the wedding. She threatened not to come because it would be embarrassing for her, but she still RSVP'd for our wedding once we explained that we would not be calling it off. What caused us to back down and remove her from the guest list though was when she showed up to my bridal shower in her wedding dress. My mom had posted about my bridal shower on Facebook with open invites, so anyone who was close with our family was able to come. Which was clearly a huge mistake. She had her wedding dress altered to be a bit shorter and fit her after her body changed a little. Most of the guest list was my family as there are not a lot of women in my fiancé's family, but his mom's sister and a couple of his female cousins had shown up. My mom politely asked her to leave, to which she refused and said I was a brat for wanting to be the only woman in her son's life. I was not wanting a big scene so I let her stay. About an hour or so later, my fiancé came to drop me some flowers. It's a tradition in our family that the man, or whoever is having the bridal shower, surprises the bride with flowers at the shower. When he came in and saw his mother's outfit he was furious. He told her he was embarrassed to be her son and told her she was no longer welcome at our wedding. She got upset and blamed me for this, saying I brainwashed him and that he never would have said something like that if not for me. Surprisingly to us, his aunt sided with his mom and said it was nice that his mom even decided to come at all after we had taken away her mother-son dance and asked her not to take a big role in the wedding. They both left, along with the cousins as his aunt was their ride. Hours later, his mom blocked me on Facebook but posted saying that we embarrassed her and that he is putting her in an uncomfortable spot by kicking her out of the wedding and that she is very hurt. The aunt backed her up by saying we were abusive towards them and they advised the rest of their family to drop out of the wedding. Following this we got several emails from his family dropping from the wedding. We expected his aunt to drop out, but so did his dad, both sets of grandparents, his cousins, and his family friends. His brother stepped down from being best man and has told us that their family is telling him not to go at all. We could not believe how many people decided not to come. The wedding is only a month away and we've paid for all of their meals and bought centerpieces for their tables. We don't know how to salvage this further.